Before starting the video, do like, share, and comment, and don't forget to subscribe our channel. So, our today's topic is about how to stop overthinking and regain your sanity. You might tend to overthink everything. You might think of things you have done, things you are going to do, and about other people's reaction to you. Even though every decision you make is momentous, and yet that doesn't take away that regret you often feel once you have made a decision, isn't it so? Your constant brain chatters keep you up at night, and makes you anxious throughout the day. But not only does your overthinking adds to your overall stress level, it's a waste of your energy as well. So, you have come to the right place, and of course, at the right time. According to the intuitive healer, Wendy Sirosa, overthinking can be attributed to anxiety, fear, the feeling of being unsafe, the need of control, feeling as if one is a fraud, worrying about not meeting the expectations of other people, or feeling of not being grounded and therefore not present. There are times when we overthink because of the way that we perceive the world and our place in it. We feel the things we see as threats, and overthinking is a way to try to control the threat and protect ourselves. Here are some tips to help you stop overthinking and regain your sanity. Change your thoughts pattern. Notify your negative thoughts into positive ones. Instead of thinking in terms of must, have thoughts and should. Focus more on your wants, choices, and preferences. If you make it so that there are tight consequences to any wrong decision, then you may find yourself paralyzed. Aim for a positive result and don't feel as if you need to analyze every detail before you make any kind of move. Give your brain something else to consider. It's the brain's job to think so. If you don't want to work over time, give it an alternative topic. If you know that the amount of time you spend thinking about your access and healthy, Trying to shift your focus to what you want a new pattern or come up with new strategies that will help you advance in your career. Let go of perfectionism. Many times you overthink as a way to avoid making a mistake and getting criticized. You believe that if you go over every detail in your mind, before you take action, you won't mess up. Not only does overthink not guarantee that you won't make any mistake, but it also makes you feel bad when you do. Going over the details of your mistakes repeatedly don't usually make you feel any better. The better plan is to do the things the best that you can. and. If they don't work out, learn from them and move on. Stop comparing yourself to others. Sometimes it can feel as if everybody is doing better than you and having a better life. So instead of feeling happy for them, you spend hours trying to come up with ways that you can one-up them. When you tend to compare yourselves to others, you tend to fall flat. You are on your own journey, and the best plan of action is to just do you. Talk to someone. If you are going round and round in your head about an issue, it may be time to get someone else's point of view. They can point out the things you are missing and help you find closure on a topic. 
have some compassion for yourself. If you are overthinking everything, then it's time to step back and focus on some self-care. You are doing the best you can and it's time to acknowledge your own worth and take care of yourself without worrying about how it could affect anybody else. Practice meditations or yoga. It's possible to overthink when your goal is to clear the mind. When you are meditating and focusing on your breathing and movement, it's easier to realize those thoughts that are stuck in your mind. When you start the cycle of overthinking, you feel freer and more at ease in your own life. So, which of these steps excited you and which of them you are gonna try? What's your point of view about overthinking and how you try to overcome it? So don't forget to share your opinion in the comment section below. So stay connected. That's all from our today's video. Thank you so much for watching. 